Now friends, this particular video is very much interesting. You just need to compare this humane AI pin with our smartphone. In this video, we are going to do a peer to peer comparison between this humane AI pin and a smartphone. Can we replace our smartphone with the human AI pin? Whether it is possible, please stop this video right here and please leave a comment. So friends, uh, this human AI pin got discovered by Mr. Imran Chaudhary and his wife Bethany in the year 2017. They were ex-Apple. They have various contributions behind the design and development of the Apple iPad, iPhone, iWatch, Apple TV, Mac OS, all the different AIs, algorithms. They have, uh, you know, numerous contribution in the Apple. Now they have, you know, uh, they have uh, introduced a new product that is Humane AI pin, a pin that gets attached to your collar and that can be, you know, a good assistant to you just like the Alexa or the Google. What to say? <laughs> now, this particular humane AI works on a operating system that is named Cosmos. So this uh, Cosmos will help you to capture all the photos, will help you to translate what to help you. It will help you to make calls, send SMX and it will be, you know, a small, smallest projector also. It can project the information on your palm. So that uh, that was, you know, a very uh, uh, some of the features of the human AI pin. But if you compare this pin with respect to our smartphone, can it will be able to replace the smartphone in near future? It got all the basic features. It can make calls. It can capture the photos. It can be, you know, it can give you the answers, quick answers. It can use the inbuilt AI chip. Um, it can give you the real time data. It will give you the analysis. It, can, it will give you everything, but that will be in the audio form. What about the visuals? If you want to capture a photo, and if you want to make sure the ang camera angles are correct, how can you do that? You just need a dedicated screen for that. In order, in terms of to capture all the selfies, you need a screen and that screen cannot be replaced by this humane AI pin. So this is the biggest disadvantages of this AI pin. However, you can reduce your screen time with the help of the AI pin, but this AI pin cannot entirely replace the smartphone because basically human is a social animal. You, you need to check Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. You want to watch my video on YouTube. You cannot do that on human AI pin. You can listen to my video, but you cannot watch my video. So this is the difference. A visual feedback should occur in a user's head. A visual feedback is very much important that cannot a user cannot experience the same in the human AIP. Uh, you cannot carry out heavy gaming, PUBG, in this human AIP. You cannot carry out uh, you know different different apps, personalization apps. Um, you cannot uh, you know use internet in that human AIP. So. So a screen is always there and it is always required to read text images. So friends, we can conclude that this humane AI pin and a smartphone cannot be compared peer to peer. However, we can reduce the screen time by using this human AI pin. It can be a good assistant just like the Alexa or Google, but it cannot replace the smartphone entirely. So friends, tell me your thoughts in the comment. I would just love to hear your thoughts. So friends, thank you so much for watching this informative video. Please subscribe to my channel, Engineers Academy.